Hey girls and guys, it's Kat, and I'm coming at you to make a quick, fast, um, kind of rant video. So, um, <clears throat> I have experienced all kinds of people in many fashions in my work life, throughout my life. Um, meet a lot of people, I've met a lot of people, um, and it never ceases to amaze me how incredibly rude some people are. Um, rude people irk me. They irk me like none other. There is no earthly reason for a person that is being serviced, that is being helped, looked after, whatever, um, with another human being um, to be rude. I abhor rudeness. It gets me to my core and will make me want to reach over and slap you just to shake some sense into you because I would guess that no one else has probably ever done it before. So this week I was blessed by God and got some great opportunities to do some work in some places and a lot of the people you know maybe feel like they're of a higher standard or a higher grade than others because of their address, their zip code where they live and want to treat you as us, right? Um, and I'm not saying everyone's like that, but I'm saying some are because I've come across it time and time again and definitely some are. And it's so incredibly sickening and it's really disgusting and it's really uncouth and it's really classless to those who think they have class that want to go ahead and tell everyone else that they have no class um, and act as if you know, their shit don't stink, and they're the hottest thing since sliced bread, and they go around with this air, like they're better than you, and they're holier than thou. Guess what? We've all got a heart, we've all got legs and eyes and feet, hands and arms, and we're all built the same way. We're all people. We're all the same people at the end of the day. None of this material stuff, none of this stuff is going to go with you to your grave, to your final resting place. You can't take it with you. What is the point? The things that you can are your integrity, the way you treat people, what you did with your time on this earth, what kind of life you lived, right? Today I worked in another event and came across um, the same set of circumstances. It's really outrageous people, but the kicker is with this is that it was kind of um, a children's event. And so the people are then carrying on this behavior and passing it down to their children and letting their children see it. And you really see how people operate. When you have a bunch of kids together and you see how these little children as young as three, four, five, six take on these characteristics because of what they learn in the household. And it's really damaging to our future society. It's really damaging because guess what? Those are going to be the future leaders. Those are going to be the people that we hold accountable. Um, and if that's their attitude and that's what they're learning in their informative years, I'm sorry for everyone that's going to be alive during that time period when they're in charge because it's going to be really outrageous um people just completely ignore the rules don't feel like they have to follow them want to do what they want to do and want to be dismissive of you when you put them in their place and guess what i will check somebody if i need to um really i'm not scared to check you i'll check you i have no qualms about checking you if i know that you have crossed the line and you need to be checked i'll check you with the quickness um yeah, so I guess this is just rant slash PSA. Just be mindful of the way that you raise your children. Be mindful of the, the examples that you set and the, the way that you live your life. Um, they're watching everything and they see everything, they pick up on everything. It's just simply a, tra a tragedy. It's a great American tragedy in my eyes. And, you know... You're not better than me just because you got more zeros in your bank account. You ain't in no way, shape, form, or fashion better than me because you have more zeros zeros in your bank account. It will never, ever matter to me. Because you can't sleep at night the same way I can't sleep at night. You get sick the same way I get sick. You have love and joy and heartache the same way I have love and joy and heartache. Doesn't make you better than me. Doesn't make me better than you. We're just people all created the same. Now man goes ahead and messes it up. 
and puts everything in these boxes with class and this, that, and the other. And want to treat certain people good and treat certain people bad. And really? You know, it's not supposed to be that way. So, I go on tomorrow to part two of this excursion. And I'm sure I'm going to have much more of the same that I had today. But I'll take it into try because I know why I'm doing what I'm doing. I know that's going to pay off. And I'm going to be in those situations where I'm going to be the one that's got all those zeros in my bank account. And I'm going to be the one that's done really well. And um, I will still treat people the same way I treat them now. With kindness and respect, even if they've given me none. And if you need to be checked, oh, you'll still be checked. <laughs> that will never change. But I will never change. Alright, peace. Later. Smooches.